Hello everyone, welcome. Bogmon here, playing a little more of the Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel. Third. Exploring the apartments now. Here in Raquel, the Entertainment City. Your dead old mother would be rolling in her dead grave, or the ditch, whichever she's in. Hey there, Ash. So I guess this is supposed to be the the character arc where we realize he's not such a bad guy. What's your place, Ash? I don't know what his place is like. Lots of books, which we kind of knew about from his book club thing. Some plants that should be very dead. Expect any drink porn all day to live. You should look over your age. Let's see the photo. Oh. You called her an old lady, but she's beautiful. Every woman in this game is beautiful. She looks so stylish, and I can tell she had a big heart, too. Meanwhile, you look very obnoxious. That's about par for the course for him. But you both look happy here. Yeah, it's not like we were starving or anything. She made good money working the night shifts. She had enough to keep us little punks fed and still managed to put some away. Oh. Yeah, I guess I am grateful to her. Most people wouldn't spend eight years raising some brat one of their regulars threw at him. I see. You must have been pretty young when you got adopted. If she passed away six years ago, eight years before that, you would have been three or four? Hell, I don't even remember. What I can say for sure is that she was a very caring and strong woman. Maybe a little too trusting for her own good, though. Oh, and her cooking was so damn bad, I had to take over myself at one point. <laughs> what a cute family you must have been. She sounds like a truly wonderful mother. If you don't mind me asking, how did she pass away? A damn tumor. Took her away in the blink of an eye. Wow, that was not the story I was expecting. She was always looking out for everyone else. But Adio sure as hell didn't look out for her. Well, life's a bitch. What else is new? Ash. <laughs> all right, buck up, people. Don't need your tears making this place all humid. It's supposed to be a dry climate. Uh, and just remembering, so you, yeah. And sometimes the reason why you have no, uh, you lose your dad, is an assassin accidentally kills them and becomes your maid. Life is weird that way. <laughs> I admit that's pretty clever, and surprisingly accurate, given that we're in the middle of a valley. On that note, I think I might let some air in. What do you say? It seems like someone's been cleaning the place, but it's still a bit dusty. Works for me. I could use a breeze. Oh, so I guess I get, don't get to explore that. Okay. Hello, doggo. The 
place is this? Maison Eclair. Michelle, here Rick, I want some omelette rice. I like it because you read her names inside a heart with ketchup. Oh. Romance! Young romance. Lady Esme. Are you my grandkids? I have so many. Oh, you lose your grandson, eh? She's been here for a while. All right. We're letting her cook. I hope that's okay. Seeing if I could double check the 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 years on that one, but apparently not. Ah, do the Jaegers go to a church? Sister Olfa. As you finally chosen to live the life of Ross Man, praise be to Adios. Fight when you need to fight. You have a pious heart, Ash. Yeah, Ash. Stop being a mean person to the ladies of the church. the other day. Things are kind of getting worse. I don't think he's listening to you. So please stop praying to win a big jackpot to save from going bankrupt. Uh, fair enough. I can imagine that is a common prayer. Let's just see that person we were told we were being followed by. Miguel. Hey, Ash. Nice to see you back here. That's Ash a... and Chevalier and students of Thor's Branch Campus, welcome to Raquel. That's a criminal sounding voice. How do you know who we are? With our uniforms and our growing publicity and being at the papers. Fair deal. 
Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. Some people, people gotta make a living somehow. Academy, using you to buy a way to complete it defeats the purpose. Is it though? I mean, did, is the, would the military be like, no, you're never ever allowed to pay a local to find out information in the area? That would be something the military would never do. Never! Okay. Uh, all right. Well, mm, the rock patio. Oh yeah, I wasn't allowed to go there. Yeah. Mm. Go there. All right. Awfully nice of him. the road. Alright. We need plants. No, it's... <laughs> He's not doing... Oh, it's definitely not what he was doing, Ash. Has approached the other ones. Anyways. What else we got? Oh, we got the barn in. Ooh, and looks like we can play cards near the casino. This is the main street. Never many people out during the day. <laughs> this place is much more fun at night. Everything about this place reminds me of Crossbell's Entertainment District. Then you should know what goes on here. Hey, Rosa. Uh, come on, spice things up. Take your job more seriously. What is his job? Or her job, sorry. Uh, informant, maybe? Mm, Rignor. Hermit bar and in. This man is drunk. You know, I didn't think I've ever gone to a bar and just gotten wasted on my own. Nor have I ever bought... God, look at the size of that bottle of wine she has in front of her. <laughs> wow! I mean, okay, yeah, so, you know... It's probably... Wow. It's gotta be like... Gotta be like a two liter bottle of wine or something. At least. No. That woman's gonna get very drunk. You don't want me today? I don't have the worst luck. So, I'm gonna guess, given the game's rating and everything, uh, that she's like. Like, you know, just, like uh, a, a, a PG-13 escort. You know, she's she's hired arm candy. Um, 
there is a higher rated game, we might give her a more adult job title. Perchance. Some hot trots been around to play off a lot lately. Baby, I know it. Uh, sounds very bender of you. Give me your signature dish, the Purple Hearts. Bright young man, Ash. Yeah, this is definitely the, uh, see, Ash isn't such a bad guy, uh, part of the story. Let's do this. So Angelica and Sarah. Thanks for waiting. Got this in the bag. Mm-hmm. She made the very good one. Now, let's begin. All right. Huh. This one. Please eat it all. I don't Even know. Even if it's not good. If it's not good, I'm not going to eat it. Whoopsie. Yeah. Almost. We're not going to eat that purple liquid. Huh. What a pain. Not bad. Let's begin. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this one tastes great. Now, let's begin. One more run of the top level people. Huh. This huh. What a pain. Let's see if we can get the fancy gold one. Huh. Not bad. Let's begin. Mm hmm. -hmm. This one tastes great. No. It's too bad. Mm, extremely precious, most valuable jewel. Casper. Mm -hmm. What is the army doing? Capital, catch the seat for me. Yeah, well, tell me about it. What's going on, old man? Crazy old man. I guess he's not that old. The Star Sapphire, 500 grand. But no one brought up Phantom Thief B. So you went and partied in town, and then you've lost it. Mm. That's why we don't need nobles. They deserve to go down. Okay. I will find it. about this actually in one of my comments how like yeah being associated with Thor should come with a certain degree of fame and respect because of the good name that Thors have and that it, even though they call it the the trash campus uh, it, it, it should be I mean if like Oxford or something was like we're opening up a second campus there'd be a degree to which their fame and reputation would lend itself to the new place. A theater. All right.
Guess we're looking around town. There it is. Mm. So we sent a telegram. We are in his own company. Typical Novu Rish. Blah blow all their hot cash. I was just talking about that. About why that's uh, that's how uh, Riviera should should adjust itself going forward. Yeah, they're sending telegrams so again. When I was talking about earlier about the weird mishmash of eras. They have, air, they have commercial airplanes, modern tanks, giant robots, the internet, but trains are popular. Cars haven't come into, ha aren't seriously in fashion yet, not fully. Um, motorbikes, basically entirely new. People still send telegrams. Clothing styles, of course. It's very odd mishmash of errors. He did show off, flashing me his fancy gem. Bragging about it. Yeah. It would be hilarious if you did have it there. Ah, oh, but apparently not. Turn and dot to the theater. As hell, no for customers. Try getting in, anyways. Mm -hmm. The guy did just let us walk past. <laughs> the most recent musicals exclusively star women, as it happens. They dress up as dudes. Popular Saint to Stride too. All right. I'd see it once. I'm, I'm kind of curious. It's good to try a variety of things. So I turn it in. So I'm showing it off again. Push him carefully all the way back to his hotel. The uh, half of him is a couple of Lamar. Oh, they have their own even fancier one. with clues. Ash looks like he might have an idea. The pawn shop, eh? Don't need to ask what a star saffron goes for. Mm -hmm. There was another zero that done in a heartbeat. 
Hmm. As of right now, he hasn't committed a crime. I mean, if you find... I'm not sure actually what the legality is of finding objects on the ground and selling them at a pawn shop. Joseph. Drinking up the hermit. Well, we will resolve this next time, I think. Thank you for watching. We'll talk to you soon.